You see, everything you are seeing here today, it started from secret faithfulness. When I was 19, I went for 10 days, no food, no water. Nobody knew. You don't know that time. You don't know. In June 10, 2026, in this country, I did 21 days, no food, no water. Nobody knew. You don't know. This is faithfulness in the secret. So when I was inside that house there, I can decide to be eating. Nobody was monitoring me. Nobody was checking. It's faithfulness. All the fast I've been to, when I was in the, when I was still young, I was going to the mountain. I used to be the youngest person in the mountain then. I don't have a church. For 10 days, I've not Eating, eating in the mountain and I'll see pastors that came there they miss fry eggs sanding you are not hearing me uh, have you seen some kind of fry 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 for bread that before the fry is over you are started speaking in tongues just try what I'm telling you in, before a month you will see your life is changing your finance everything faithful with everything God everything that is around you since this ministry started today we have never missed tight every any month we pay tight as a ministry since I knew Prophet Jeremiah when he spoke about tight. Since then, I've never missed tight till today. More than 10 years. All the time I gave serious giving, that God pronounced over my life true riches. So anywhere I go, I'll be favored. I'm not, it's not, it's not the environment that blesses me. Anywhere, blessings have been pronounced over me. And you, you don't have choice than to bless me. You don't know why. You don't have choice than to come here and say, we are going to prophet David. It's not you that choose you. There's a pronounced blessing on me. True riches. It's called true riches. Hear the good news today. May the Lord grant you the spirit of faithfulness. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Before I became a, a man of God taking care of people, when I was in school, I was the head of the hostel from grade 7 to grade 12. I was the head of the house. So it's me that is everybody. I can't, I mean, people, if we are 150, then I say we are 170. So 20 people food is for me. I'm my sister. You are not hearing me. <laughs> now, are, are you hearing me? You, are, you don't read your Bible. Immediately somebody call you, you just, or somebody knock on your door, you just bring your Bible out and be doing, I'm studying. I, I love God. I, I, you don't know me. I, I, I've been praying. You don't pray. It's when people see you, you say, hey, ah! Lulu, KK, <laughs> you are not serious with yourself. Is it you can deceive all everybody? You can't deceive yourself. Only yourself know whether you are fake. This is what faithfulness means. This is a sign of unfaithfulness. It starts from home. You, you, yes, it's obvious that this man's shoe is not in, in his wardrobe now. His clothes is not in the wardrobe. So he drink and he put it on the floor. We're leaving the house this morning. This kind of can was inside the car. So because we're in the east, I was not late, but I'm in the east to get him very on time. I threw it out and I called those at home while I was inside the car. I said, there's something outside, make sure you put it in the waste bin before you leave. Imagine ordinary waste, something outside like this. Make sure you pick it, I threw it there now, make sure you put it in the waste bin before you drive. Leave them, leave them. <laughs> you, want, <laughs> you want to pick it? Oh yeah, pick it. He's, he's still putting it in the corner. Go and throw it away. It's fine. Go and throw it away. You are receiving the spirit of faithfulness. Yeah. And you are entering into your next level. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Yeah.